We all know the best way to end the work week is with puppies. Joining me today <laughs> for Furry Friends Friday is Jessica Green with Lucky Lab Rescue. She's Hello. brought along some real treats. Literally, we've got all food names Hi. for these pups. Tell us about don't jump, don't all jump. of them. Oh, oh, oh no. Oh, wait. Oh, Klondike's good. This is the joy make, of live TV. Oh, my goodness. There we go. Okay. You need me to take one? Well, there we go. All right. So we, we have Klondike and we've got truffle sleeping over there mm -hmm. and then we've got nibbles and mocha and dumpling and jambalaya of course the creole girl has to have jambalaya <laughs> so tell me a little bit about these guys how old are they where'd you get them these guys are seven weeks old they came in with a, a pregnant mama and uh, to lucky lab and then uh, they are seven weeks old they had their first round last week and then they will be ready to go to their new homes really soon. Okay, first round of shots last week? Yep, first okay. round of shots were last week. Perfect, and you know what's funny is these are so cute. We love to love on these puppies, but you guys actually need a lot of help with these guys, right? Puppies are a lot of work, and you know, we've got the, the fosters that take them for you know eight weeks, and then after eight weeks, it's time to split the litter so that you can start kind of learning you know, how to, how to be good dogs and not just part of a puppy litter. Mm -hmm. So we really need fosters so that we can split the litters and they can take them for, you know, up to a month. At a time? Yeah, That's a month at good. a time. Yeah. yeah, you can just have a little taste, a little, a little taste, taste of, of a lab. Well, That's and then right. you'll fall in love and want to keep them. That's the problem. Or you'll realize you're not ready. Okay, either, <laughs> either or. Come get a puppy for a month. Okay, That's so right. Just if people are interested, how can they reach you? What's the best way? Uh, they can email me at luckylabaustin at gmail.com. Um, that's to foster, and we, we really, really need fosters. Uh, we also have a couple volunteer positions open that okay. we're needing filled for adoptions and to manage fosters. Perfect, and people who do decide to foster, you guys hook them up with supplies and help them out, right? So it's not We have a lot like of it. donated food yeah. and treats. We pay for all medical and preventatives, and so that all that cost is covered. We just you know, ask you to, to love them and put a roof over their head. And this particular bunch, guys, they're so chill, except for Klondike, who's trying to wake up everyone else. Yeah, that's All right. of the other puppies are asleep. <laughs> they're just really chill puppies. So really fun. And, you know, any particulars on the type of home that would be good for someone who may be thinking about fostering? Should they be someone who doesn't have animals no. or kids okay? Oh, yeah. Kids and animals and cats and, and all of that is great. We do have a couple dogs that, you know, require, you know, maybe an being only pet home or mm -hmm. something like that. But the majority of them, they're great with dogs, cats, kids. It's all an awesome foster environment for them. Fantastic. Jessica, mm -hmm. thank you so much for joining us, guys. You can go to LuckyLabRescue.com if you want more information. We'll have a final look at your weekend forecast after the break.